Okay, guys, this is where I'm at. I'm inside the World Trade Center, two World Trade Center mall. And I went into the Sephora. I couldn't record too much, so, you know, I had to do it on the DL. But I got some pretty cool stuff this time. And I'm going to show you. I'm going to show you everything I purchased so you guys can see. So, stay tuned. Okay, so the second floor has a better view. Let me show you. There's some bougie-ass doors over here. So you know I'm not going to be shopping there, but it's cute or whatever. Take a look at all of this. So beautiful. This is my second time being here. I live in New York City and for some reason I never visited here. But I happened to be working around and I was like, you know, I'll go take a look. But it's really nice. Very bougie though. Dude, everything is sold out. All the foundations. What the hell? Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. Today we have a very special video, as you can tell. I have um, festival inspired makeup. I thought I would do something different for this video just because like, I feel like my makeup lately has been very basic, to say the least. So, you know, I had a little extra time. I was watching my show on Netflix and I was just experimenting with some of the colors, um, some of the loose pigments from the previous video that I showed. So I am wearing two on my eyes and they're so pretty and then I thought I would add a little bit of the gems and all of that stuff so I like the way it turned out anyways for today's video we're actually gonna be doing a little haul video I'm gonna be showing you the stuff that I purchased at Sephora I went to Sephora the other day and I purchased some things you know I didn't really know what I was going in there for I just went in there and I was like you know I want to buy something actually I'm lying I did I did know what I want I wanted a tinted moisturizer or some like sort of foundation like a bb cream or a cc cream that would be light for my skin to wear now that we're starting like spring and summer something very light and i'm actually wearing it right now and i am loving it and it's like really like sheer to medium coverage and i love it other than that there's other things that i found here some other goodies that i'm excited to show you guys yeah if you guys want to see what i purchased at sephora then just keep on watching Product, the first product is a skincare product and I actually purchased this product from this brand it's called Tatcha I'm pretty sure you guys have heard of it it's a Korean brand Korean I think so I might be wrong let me skincare for makeup lovers instant dewy glow set now this is a cool set this set actually cost me $56 and it says here that it retails or that the value would be $78 so um I'm not gonna lie to you guys the the first thing that I saw in this product that I was like you know I'm gonna get this product was this right over here the the luminous dewy skin mist and we see this all over Instagram we see this all over YouTube a lot of famous youtubers have mentioned this and I did try it a couple times whenever I go into a Sephora and it like first of all it smells really good and then second like it leaves your skin really dewy so I'm loving it. I'm not sure if this is a full size, but if it is a full size, that's pretty cool that I can get a full size for $56. The next product is the Your One Step Camellia Cleansing Oil. So I love any anything that's cleansing, especially when it's an oil base, because my skin tends to be very, very dry, especially when I take off my makeup. So this, my skin is going to love it. I know it. And then the last one is the Violet Violet C Radiance Mask. Now, this mask, I've seen Jeffree Star um, post a lot about it. He even did a review on, on YouTube, and it looked pretty good. So I'm definitely excited. It is a little tiny sample, so you know it's something that I can try and see if I like it, which I know I am because Tatcha products are really good. I've tried like their, um, their exfoliators, and they're amazing. So 
I think I'm going to be loving this one. I can't wait to try it. I still have it in the packaging. I purchased this a few days ago, but I wanted to show you guys, so I didn't open it yet. But yeah, I'm excited for this one. Second product that I bought, which I'm excited about, is also sort of like a skincare makeup product that has a lot of hype. This is the Farsali Rose Gold Elixir. The Farsali Rose Gold Elixir. And this is the little sample size. Um, this size is... 0.34 ounces and the price for this was $20 so for $20 you get the little sampler size and I used it once and I think I really really like it because I need something that's like a primer but I'm like honestly I'm so tired of all the primers that I have like the like the silicone-ish um, base um, primers I'm just I'm over it so I I remember that years ago i used to love using oils beauty oils as um something to prep my skin so this is something that really caught my eye and i've seen it you guys have seen it all over instagram or do those little you know those little drops all over their face from the rose gold elixir and i wanted to try for myself and um this definitely did not disappoint me for the first time that i used it i'm definitely going to continue to use it you know that's pretty cool and then the second product, which is the product that I intended to get, was um, this right here is an instant moisture and glow. So it's sort of like a foundation, but it's more like a tinted moisturizer slash BBCC cream kind of. It doesn't really state what it is like like product wise. Like it's, it just says bright future. And this is from the Sephora collection. But what caught my attention, and I think this is new, what caught my attention was that it said that it had SPF 25, so I really needed something that had SPF to protect my skin. Since I can't touch up, like if I'm wearing makeup, I can't touch it up. And I wanted something that would give me that dewy glow and also moisture. So this was like a three-in-one, and honestly, I'm loving it a lot. This, the shade that I'm wearing is 31 Almond. I matched myself while I was there, and I love it. I'm wearing it today I've been wearing it for the past few days since I purchased it and I think this is it I think this is the product that I'm gonna be using for the summer because it's very lightweight and you know especially like I really really wanted it because like sometimes when you wear a, like full makeup like we all want to look glamorous we all want to wear a full face makeup you know what I mean and when the sun hits you like you can see that cake like you can see that it's cakey so I wanted something where I can look like you know put together but I can also layer it if I need a little more coverage but I also don't want to look cakey and this is perfect because it's gonna give me that dewy sun kiss glow kind of look and I'm loving it so I'm very glad um, Sephora collection has actually made a product like that and that it was very cheap too it was it was $18 so it's pretty cool I'm loving that and then last but not least, the most exciting product that I... I didn't even know I was going to find this, okay? I didn't even know until the cashier told me, Oh, everyone's coming in for these. Everyone is looking for these. And have just been released in Sephora. So I'm excited. I'm actually very lucky that I got these, apparently, according to the cashier. These are the Lily Lashes for Sephora Collection. They look like this. Let me take them out of the packaging so you can see. Now this is her. Lily Galici is so beautiful. She, oh my God, her lashes, her hair, her makeup, everything flawless. And these are the lashes that I purchased. These lashes are in the style. What are they? Mykonos. Mykonos, and these are like the. I believe this is the most, the more dramatic version of the lashes. And these lashes, I am actually gonna be using them for eye mats, which I'm very excited. I didn't. I didn't really think about what I was gonna like do my makeup how to do my makeup or or what to wear or whatever but I definitely know that I will be wearing these lashes and I'm at is like two weeks away so I'm excited these are really nice these are really nice I'm loving them these were a little expensive these were $30 but for mink lashes keep in mind that you can use them up to 20 to 25 times so this is it's, a, it's an investment and then you have to like really take care of them so that you know keep them in a box or keep them somewhere safe and then you can use them over and over and over again so that's cool thank you so much for watching again and i will see you on the next video bye